premier sports betting show, The Primetime Angles, with your boy, the one and only Pop DBIC, the primetime capper. And as you can see, the Dodgers do it again. Dodgers with another, with another West title. And I know all the Dodger fans are very proud today, all that good stuff. I know my dad's looking for it down from above, very happy that his boys have done it again. And pretty much the Dodgers have won another series this season. That's that's just commonplace. And they captured the NL West title for the 11th time in 12 years. So the Dodgers have pretty much reached the status of and now in invincibility somewhat in the uh, West. It's the Dodgers and the four little uh, Chiefs. That's all it is. And the four little elves or whatever you want to call it, the four little dwarves. It doesn't matter. It's like the Dodgers are a absolute, are the lead singer of a band, and there's no way that the other guys are going to be able to have their own lead songs. The Dodgers just go about their business year in and year out and just win this division. They've won this division in so many ways where they've won the division by one game and where they've won the division by 30 games. The Dodgers are absolutely incredible when it comes to division play over the last decade and it's just unmatched i haven't seen a team with this type of run ever you know what i mean the yankees wish they had a run going like this the cubs wish they had a run like this the only other team that can say they had a run similar to this is the braves that's it so the dodgers really do play up to a standard and it totally shows now they can focus in on the playoffs, all that good stuff, but the Dodgers don't care. The Dodgers know what time it is. They know that they have to keep going. They got to keep churning. They got to keep going about their business in the correct sense because they want to win the World Series. So you have to close these teams out. The Dodgers have realized in the month of September, we can't let up off the gas like that. We got to keep our momentum going because we don't want to get sidetracked. And you know what? They know that they could play spoiler this weekend. And what they did was they pretty much said that we're not letting anybody get to get to the playoffs on our back. And if they are going to get to the playoffs on our back, they're going to have to work for it. We're not going to sit up in here and lay down just because we just won the division title. No, because we are on two bigger things and we have to use these games against the better teams as situations on how to beat them in a series. We can't sit up in here and say, well, you know, let's go ahead and play all the guys that we just brought up from the farm. So then we can get some guys some rest. These guys been get rested twice, twice a week. OK, so that's why the Dodgers have put themselves in position to where nobody needs to have excessive rest anymore. These guys can just if they're if they're not hurt. OK, so these guys are just playing baseball, going about their business, being great at doing that. And another thing is Jason Hayward is an absolute gem. And Jason Hayward can be the difference in the Dodgers winning a World Series and losing a World Series this year. Hopefully he stays healthy throughout these next uh, few weeks and months. And the Dodgers have him as a vital asset on their run to a title, but it's going to, it's going to take a lot. We know that because getting through the regular season is one thing, but then when you get into the second season, that takes on a whole different mind of its own and nothing is guaranteed. It don't matter if you want 120 games during the season. It's all about winning those three games or those four games and moving along. That's what it's all about. It's not about what you did during the regular season. It's about winning your series during the playoffs. And the Dodgers know that for – they know that. They know how this goes. They know how it works. They've been at the top of the mountain, and they've been where a lot of teams don't want to be, where you're out in the first round with several hundred expectations of winning a championship. So – they truly are in a league of their own when it comes to winning division titles, but they are gonna. They know this is not the end goal. The end goal is to raise up the trophies with all the flags on it. So we will see if the Dodgers can get themselves in position to win a World Series. I know I talk about this at least once a week. But after winning this, this 11th title in the last 12 years, I'm not impressed anymore. 
I think that now it's time to think about getting the NL pennant and getting yourselves in the World Series. How can you only go to three World Series in this time? Answer that. Three World Series in this time. And you've won 11 division titles. You got to do better. And the Dodgers know that. And Dodger fans know that. So with that, we move forward. Let's go ahead and talk about the MLB pennant race. And the MLB pennant race has gotten really, really, really fun. Because what's happening now is we have a lot of teams in play 